here at Battle Island, there's a couple hundred acre uh, portion of a uh, mature forest in the center of it. And a uh, big rocky and I often bushwhack through it, but today we're taking the a nice little trail that cuts through it and then goes along a river, but you see uh, hundreds of thousands of uh, old growth hemlock, big oak trees, some big white pines. It's incredible. Um, you know, and then you see an eagle or something like that fly by. Marjorie, I see eyes at night time, so plenty of wildlife out here. Beautiful forest. Look at that giant hemlock. Extraordinary. Um, real nice here at Battle Island. So if you want to go for a easy snowshoe with your dog or kids, it's a winter wonderland right now. And now we come out onto the uh, beautiful Oswego River where there's a junction where if we would have not gone through the woods where we just came out, we would have went around the backside of the golf course and it's a long loop that comes down through here. You can see there's a nice, uh, nice single track of uh, cross country ski all broken out and the snowshoe path on the left. So, great little cross country ski route, great snowshoeing. You wanna do some bushwhacking, beautiful forest. And we got about a half mile walk along the river here, which is pretty frozen right now. It's beautiful, so Battle Island. Loop trail. steep hill right there. That's good for sledding. That's where I actually learned how to snowboard. And you can go a couple different ways here. While you're looking at the expanse of the river there. You can go back directly up this way, straight back to the car. Or you can follow this trail here, which goes a long ways around. Then we're gonna cut off to the right and visit some old uh, Erie Canal antique stuff from the old days. So. Pretty cool stuff, lot to do here if you uh, want to spend a nice half day adventure. So I begin my bushwhack to the Erie Canal ruins right here, which is uh, pretty cool. Lots of old blow down in here and stuff, so we crawl over some of this and we'll show you what we're going to. Got some historical ruins here from the uh, Erie Canal back in the days when. Everything was delivered by boat in this region. That's what uh, built America, basically. Everything came through here at one time. And uh, pretty wild. There's a little island over there. You could probably actually walk across the ice to there right now. But instead, we're gonna traverse this little knife edge here. The snowshoes. Whoa! We don't fall off it. <laughs> yeah. Good stuff. You can see where there's some deer and stuff like that visiting this little island right here. So that little island's our objective as well. Check that out one second. Get across this big, big guy here and we'll have a look. There it is. Come on, Rock! Come here, buddy! Rocky's kind of scared to go across the uh, bridge. And uh, hope I don't have to jump in the water to save him. Good job, pal. Okay, from the golf course, we we're looking out into this bay. Back there is the actual channel of the Spiegel River. This is a little bay that goes around, and uh, that's Battle Island right there. And this is where the battleships uh, supposedly fought in the Revolutionary War. We were shooting at the British ships coming up the stream. Um, there's a nice little campsite right on the uh, right end of the island, right there, beautiful campsite. And, uh, sometimes you can paddle up to a nice fire pit. And on the opposite side of the island, you see all them oak trees, it's all oak. There's another campsite on the other end, which I visited this summer, but there's a lot of ticks. But that is Battle Island, pretty neat. And here the river's frozen in this section, so we're going to walk around this little island here, and then beeline back to the golf course. So. A lot of geese and stuff chilling out, hanging out over there. 
see a couple swans in the back too. Probably can't see them on the video, but there's two swans back in there. Lots of geese, good stuff. It's always scary doing a, a water crossing. Shores right there, so I'm prepared to hightail it. Needed. <laughs> Pretty awesome, though. Okay, and before we finish things up with the car, there's one more little ancient dam we're gonna visit. This little guy right here in here uh, one time it was dammed up and this was obviously a reservoir in here used for something uh, now it's a little stream obviously this was functional way before my time on this planet but pretty cool what you find when you go off the main path in the woods a lot of cool little stuff here in central new york <laughs> 